Mm-hmm. Delicious. Hey everybody, Mikey Kid Outdoors here. So what are we doing today? I'm doing a little uh, test run of my large fire kit from TJM Metalworks out of the UK. Got a small one of these and been wanting to get the big one for a while. So I bought this. I've had it now for a couple months, but just uh, finally getting around to grilling up some pork chops and filet mignon and salmon. So it's going to be pretty good. So let's check it out. Well, these guys are getting to the point where I might want to look at them on the bottom and swing this away from the fire a little bit. So I'm take a peek. Yeah, let's see what we got here. Salmon's cooking up pretty well. Might use a spatula if I need to. Get these open. Ooh, that's browning up nice. These bacon wrap steaks here. Oh, that's looking nice. And I got some smoked pork chops. I got a local uh, butcher. They're cooking up. Like the uh, sage fell down. I'm gonna flip the rest of these over. Get the cooking away. Well, those are cooking up pretty nice. Kind of buggered up the one there on the end a little bit, but <laughs> yeah, it's salmon likes to stick to the grills. Now, one thing about this large one compared to the small one, besides the obvious that it's bigger, the uh, grill fits kind of the opposite. So this one, you've actually got the lip on this side, and you can always tell because your wrap is going to go down on your pole there for this to angle up right. So yeah, that's a uh, pretty nice grill. And I got some other accessories for it too. There, I just seasoned them up a little bit. Threw a little paprika, onion flakes on the uh, pork and the steak. I got uh, a little bit of sage on those pork chops and a little bit of oregano and basil where appropriate. But yeah, I uh, got this kit, and it's got a uh, like flat, I'll say about a 12 inch wide or so, a uh, little griddle pan that you can fry up eggs or vegetables or whatnot on. And then uh, I got a little uh, pot stand, little circular trivet looking arm, and then I got the traditional uh, little hook that you can hang a pot from. So those are the additional arms that I've got with this kit. And for, you know, camping with a family or something, or it's more than just yourself or maybe another person, you know, it's nice to have the larger kit and comes in fairly well. I got a couple of their other little uh, grills that I got too. So it's good to have a variety depending on what situation you're gonna be in. And every trip's gonna be a little different. And, on you know, this, I just wanted to try this one out, so it's working pretty good. You can adjust the height wherever you want it. So when you got a fire going, you know, you can swing your food out of the way, prep it up as you need to, and then swing it back over, adjust the height as needed, and you're good to go. Oh, well, salmon looks pretty good. I got my little bag of seasonings there on the table. And I'm just finishing up the steaks and the chops. <laughs> poke them through. They seem to be pretty good in the center. Be nice and delicious. Well everyone, I'm going to wrap this up. So if you like what you've seen, feel free to like, comment, subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. Uh, hit that notification bell for notifications on new content when it's available. And I'll catch you again in the outdoors. As always, thanks for watching.